I took a trip to Barnes & Noble, and I came back with this and more. So let's get cracking! Hey, my explorers, and welcome back to Lauren's Adventures Out There. If you're new, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate it. My name is Lauren, and I'm with Castle Capes and Clones, where we discuss everything in the Disney universe. We do unboxings and hauls, pins, box swaps, Disney news, Disney reviews, and more. So if that sounds like it's something that's interesting to you, we'd love it if you would subscribe to our channel, hit that bell for notifications, and do like this post as it really helps your favorite content creators know that you appreciate them. And we in turn appreciate that. So I went to Barnes and Noble and I kind of went a little bit nuts. Now, for those of you who watch this channel, you know that I collect little golden books. And this is the stack that I came back with. They had so many good ones there and I needed to get them. So let's go ahead and go through what I got in terms of little golden books. So here we have Walt Disney's Bambi. This is not, this is a reprint obviously. Uh, since I got it at the place, but I just love the illustrations in this. It's just, just beautiful illustrations. This is like a, a reprint of an old Bambi book. Uh, and I, I like it better than the reprints that they've done where it, matches a little bit more to the actual animated style. I personally love when they go with more of the, um, the, the kind of concept art style. So anyway, I like it. All right. The next book, uh, I'm like shaking the camera here. The next book that I have is a book of about a woman that I very much respect she was one of our senators here in california uh that i thought did an amazing job and she is now the vice president of the united states and i think that she's just an incredible woman i'm so proud that she is not only the first african-american um vice president but also the first asian american president uh, president because she is part uh, India or I, I actually I, I should not say that South Asian uh, I'm not exactly sure which um, thing but there we go it's Women's March she's uh, all about LGBTQ rights I love the fact that little golden books are doing uh, these books uh, showcasing you know strong women and there she is with Joe Biden who is the current president of the United States for those of you who don't pay attention <laughs> all right so now I have talking about strong women and um, little in little gold books this is my little golden book of Betty White and Betty White is our national treasure. She is just, I mean, she has had a storied career and she's just uh, amazing. She's an animal rights activist. Here's, um, and she does a lot of work with the LA Zoo. Uh, you know, she was in one of the funniest shows ever, The Golden Girls, amongst others. She was in the Mary Tyler Moore show. She was in, um, on uh, the Carol Burnett show as, uh, and, um, others. She had her own show. 
So, very fun. All right, so then next I got It's a Small World After All. Disney has been doing these uh, books based on their attractions. And I really want to get the one. This is based on Disneyland, so you can tell because it's got Peter Pan in it, it's got um, Alice in Wonderland in it, and it's very cool. But I like how they've been doing these attraction books. I hope that they eventually do the Enchanted Peak Room. That would make me very happy. Guten Tag. And Alps. Let's see. Here we are in Asia. Very cool. And you saw Mulan up there. I'm sure. Here they are in. Uh, South America and Mexico. And then we have where they are in the South Seas. So very cool. Okay, next one is this one I'm very excited about. This is uh, the next. Disney animated feature to come out, Encanto, and uh, this book is about Encanto. I actually don't know if I'm going to read this before I watch the movie or or what, because I don't want to be spoiled. So I'll probably wait until after the movie to see this. I mean to read this. Okay, so next up we have Peter Porker, the spectacular Spider-Ham, and he was popularized in the um, Spider-Verse movie, um, and he was he was actually created in the 1980s uh, as a joke character, but um, the Spider-Verse really kind of brought him out as a hero unto himself. Very cool. That one, kind of sad, the little golden strip is coming off here. Okay, the next one was based on the the Pixar short, Bow. I didn't even know that they made this until I went to the Barnes & Noble and found it. This is one of my favorite Pixar shorts for sure. It's very kind of melancholy and sad, but at the same time, adorable. All right. Then we have Loki. And this is not based on anything. It's just kind of uh, his own story. Um, there he is. Thor. And talked about him being best friends with Thor. But he's always messing up with Thor at, at the same time. go. Alright, so then the next one is Soul. I never got this one. But um, obviously based on the Pixar movie Soul. Very nice. Very cool. All right, and then the final book we have here for, in terms of go, little golden books, is Shang Chi, and this one I don't think is based on the movie. Like I think it just kind of does its own thing. 
from what I understand, yeah, it is. But this is fun. I'm glad to have that. Alright, so those are the little golden books that I got. Now, to show you two other things that I did get as well. The first one here is Neil Gaiman's Eternals. They, as you know, uh, next Friday, uh, the 5th, will be the opening night of uh, Marvel's Eternals. And um, I remember reading them as a kid, the old Jack Kirby ones. Uh, didn't get a chance to read the Neil Gaiman ones, but I heard that they pull from this book a lot. So I uh, definitely want to make sure that I read this one as well. And then when I was in the children's section looking at the little golden books, I happened to um, kind of wander through one of the aisles and I saw this Who's Who from A to Z Disney characters. And I'd never seen this book before, but I thought, this is pretty cool. Look at this. Like, they have the Fox and the Hound. Let's see. Do they have the Rescuers? Let's take a look. <gasps> oh, my God. There's my Miss Bianca. Even Rude. Your own Brutus. How cool, Bernard. So this is fun. I definitely am looking forward to looking through this whole thing. And they have, um, not only do they have Disney, but they also have um, Pixar as well. So there's Inside Out. So it's just a whole, I mean, seriously, this is pretty comprehensive. I love it. I can't wait to look through this whole book. Anyway, that is it. Uh, that is my sh haul from Barnes & Noble. I hope you enjoyed yourself. And if you did, we'd love it if you would subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell for notifications. And do like this post as it really does help us out. Um, if you hear dogs running around, my I'm currently... Um, how, uh, dog sitting my sister's dogs and they are playing um, so anyway and have a good time uh, anyway uh, if you enjoy yourself we would love it if you would subscribe to the channel hit the bell for notifications and do like this post as it really does help us out uh, visit us on all of our socials down below visit our website at www.castlescapesandclones.com thank you so much for joining us and we will see you later bye